Okay, you guys, it's VR Monday, so I welcome you to VR Monday. Uh, before we begin, we are going to start having merch, so I need to rip this off. So if you guys aren't aware, if you guys aren't following the secondary channel, we are going to start making some sort of merch. There's a person now in the Discord server that has the merch designer role. And uh, if you have any additions, contact her, but she's absolutely incredible. And uh, she sent me some ideas already and I told her I love them. So that's what we're working on. And of course, don't worry, I'm paying her in t-shirts, so she's good with that. But we are going to keep it very simple, very minimalistic. So I have my black t-shirt. We're mainly doing this for Poland because I'm not sure if all of you guys are aware. There's a massive, massive trip coming up where we're all going to Poland. We're all just gonna live together and there's gonna be crazy amount of vlogs. And uh, don't worry, the daily vids are still coming. But yeah, it's going to be absolutely insane. So yeah, we're gonna be printing this on our own and I was just checking them out. So that's why I'm wearing it. VR Monday, let's get into it. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to record properly on your Oculus Quest. This has been such a popular question. So I'm going to show you two ways of doing this. Uh, number one, you will need a PC to activate both, but for one of them, you will need a PC to record the footage. It doesn't need to be a good PC. All it needs to do is be able to run SideQuest. The first one that we are going to do, you will need SideQuest literally just to run a few commands or ADB, whichever one is your preferred option. So without further ado, let's grab the Quest and I'm gonna show you both these ways that you can use to record full screen on your Oculus Quest. So here's my Oculus Quest. A lot of people ask what mods I have on my Oculus Quest every video. So Kiwi Design head strap, then we have the VR cover. We have the Kiwi Design plate for kind of protecting the inside of my lenses. Then we have Vidmo VR, which is for my prescription lenses. And then, and that's actually pretty much it. And then I have my vinyl on the front. So that's my, well, that's what my Quest looks like. And uh, according to me, this is just infinite comfort right now. So, oh, somebody tightened this. Uh, very soon, I'm going to show you guys a way to connect a microphone to your Oculus Quest so that you can record audio on this beast with a different microphone. Because I mean, as good as the microphone is on the Oculus Quest, you could be getting better. And I got contacted by an amazing company. We're going to be making that happen. And I'm sure you guys are going to love that because that was also a question that came up quite a lot. So we have my magnetic connectors. So let's connect the Oculus Quest to our PC. Okay, cool. So as you guys can see, we're here now. Let's launch SideQuest. So the first method I'm going to show you guys is going to make it so that you can record full screen straight on your Oculus Quest. Now, according to me, this method isn't ideal because you have to redo it every time you turn on and off the Oculus Quest. So according to me, that's not very ideal. But in case you don't want to be recording on your computer and you want to be recording straight on your Quest, this method will allow you to record full screen 16 by 9 straight on your Oculus Quest using the default recording software. So I have the code here and uh, you want to run this one by one inside quest or an ADB. You want to click up here, run ADB commands, custom command, and you just want to control V it into here. So you just want to run all of these one by one, like so. These are setting the bit rates, the new resolution, the frames per second, everything like that. What I have found is this does actually lag my quest a little bit more when I'm recording at this higher resolution, which is why I prefer the second option I'm going to be showing you guys. So now if you grab your Oculus Quest and put it on, you can start recording and you should actually be able to record in full 1080p, 16 by nine aspect ratio on your Oculus Quest. So let's try that right now. Here, record video. And now we are recording video straight on the Oculus Quest. You can see the red dot, and we should be recording in 16 by nine aspect ratio, just like this. Cool. So now that I've shown you that, I'm going to show you the second option, which is my preferred option. So once again, you wanna connect your Oculus Quest to your computer, just like that. Uh, I apologize for the fans in the background. Uh, I got my new Ryzen 5 3600X and um, my water cooler just isn't really cutting it right about now. Again, you wanna launch SideQuest. You wanna make sure your PC and your Quest are on the same network. Now, I have actually done this with a hotspot in my garden and it worked perfectly fine. So it doesn't matter whether you actually have internet or not. It just needs to be on the same network. So we click up here on SideQuest. This will enable uh, ADB through Wi-Fi, which is actually a feature all Android phones have. And the Quest is an Android, so it has it as well. So you just want to click connect. It says attempting Wi-Fi connection. You will hear a sound. There you go. Now you just want to disconnect your Quest. Make sure that SideQuest still says connected. When it says connected, that's how you know you are actually still connected to the Quest without a cable. So now you can click the little TV icon here. You can select your default options. I just use the default that come with SideQuest. 
click start stream, then you can full screen it, put on your Oculus Quest, and you will get the image from your Oculus Quest straight on to your computer, just like that. And because I have a five gigahertz network, I have very little latency. How the actual do I recenter? All right, I forgot how to recenter, but here you go. This is my preferred method of recording, as I said, because number one, it doesn't take up the storage on the Oculus Quest. Number two, it already puts the footage on my computer where you will probably be using it. Number three, this is actually how we streamed Half-Life Alex, because you can use this to stream using OBS to any platform you like. And number four, this doesn't lag my quest. And also that red dot isn't there. But of course, as most of us know, we can actually disable that red dot now, but blah, blah. That's why this would actually be my preferred method of streaming. So, I mean, that's going to be it, you guys. Um, there really, really isn't much more to it. Pretty simple, pretty simple procedure. And uh, I hope it helped you out. I hope you now learned how to record 16 by 9 aspect ratio on your Oculus Quest so that you can throw it straight onto your computer and have good footage without black bars on the side. Before we end this video, I want to answer a few questions because there has been a few questions. A lot of people are asking why we're not recording games and uh, the simple answer to that is this is a tech channel. Uh, we do have a second channel where you guys can watch us play games if you want to. Uh, we have Monozacop, which currently doesn't have any videos because my friend hasn't moved his arse to record on there yet. but we also have Mystical More, which is the main second channel for this account, where we actually have live streamed Half-Life Alex, and we have uploaded two other videos, which is where we kind of upload extras, random videos, vlogs, etc. And when we're in Poland, the vlogs, I'm not sure where they're going to go. You guys, I'm going to ask you guys whether you want the vlogs to go on the main channel and act as on our own series too, or whether you guys want the vlogs to go on Mystical More, where the footage would probably fit a little bit more. I'm going to have to ask you guys on the Discord server. So if you guys aren't part of the discord server yet make sure to join that because the community there is absolutely booming and that's where i ask you guys all the questions that i feel uh you guys could contribute with for example uh you guys can tell me there your video suggestions this was actually a video suggestion multiple times there as well so great minds think alike i guess on the discord server we also just post a bunch of memes we talk about anything we talk about life the channel is mostly for having fun so please no like racism no no things like that we want to keep it very family friendly i want to everybody to be happy there but yeah that is going to be it for today's video you guys if you guys liked this video i post tech videos daily and vr videos on mondays and fridays if that floats your boat make sure to smack that subscribe button with your forehead ding my bell become part of the 360p gang follow me on my social media here and here because that's how i communicate with you guys uh, join our discord join our reddit where i want to see you posting spicy memes so that i can review them someday and once again you guys if you want to be notified of future content make sure to subscribe ding my bell and see you again in the next one. Peace. And actually, I don't know how I keep forgetting this. A lot of people keep asking for this. This is actually one of the t-shirt ideas. If you guys want to see it, make sure to like ping her uh, so that she can send it on to you guys. But um, the mug sip. And a lot of people don't get the mug sip. Not, not a lot of people get that it's a meme on this channel and they get really pissed. Like one guy just was really disrespectful in the comment section there a few days ago, telling me that nobody wants to see my shit coffee. Guys, come on. Stop being rude. What's the toxicity about? This is just a meme. And ASMR for the people that like it. <laughs> Minecraft mug. Peace. So I promised you guys I would post your art at the end of the videos. Well, there's finally enough art on the Discord server to post. So, here it is. Actually, here is a video from our new t-shirt designer. Make sure to check her out right up here. That's all I'm gonna show. If you guys want the full thing, go check her out. So I'm really loving you guys posting your art, so if you want your art to be featured, if you want your art to be shown at the end of the video, make sure to join the Discord server, send your videos, send your art, show us what you can do, because I'm really loving the community and I'm loving what you guys are sending on to me, so if you want your art to be featured, make sure to send it on, and uh, join the Discord.